What is happening, Hardwood Nation? I'm your online host, Blaine Carraher, and join with me here on the set of Hardwood Heroes is Trimble reporter Austin Carpenter. So tonight, Trimble, they continued their season, their head to the combo. They took down Waterford tonight, 73 to 66. So now Austin, this team, they're very physical, and they've been chipping away for this all year. That's right, Blaine. The Tomcats proved their toughness tonight with a very good win over the Waterford Wildcats. You know, it was the first half, it looked like it was gonna be a close game. Couldn't really tell which team was gonna pull away. You know, it was tied at the end of the first quarter. Trimble had a two-point lead going into halftime. You know, Waterford was really relying on the three-point shot tonight. They could not get the ball inside. They couldn't really body, body the bigs that Trimble has so there. Relied on three-point shooters. They were knocking them down. They're 10 to 17 from behind the arc in the first half. And Trimble, they did a great job of playing defense in the first half. You know, they're switching defenses. They started the game off with a full court man to man press and they switched to a 3 2 zone later on in the second quarter. They're just playing phenomenal defense. So now, Austin, I know I feel a little bit like a broken record, but I know this Trimble team, they're physical and they're, they're deep with their roster. Tell me about some of the players that impacted this game. Well, Blaine, there's a, I'm going to throw a couple names out to you. First one being Micah Couch. Mal Micah Couch is the big man down low for the Tomcats. He had 21 points, 11 boards tonight. He was 9 of 13 from the field. He was just a beast. He was bullying everybody tonight on the Waterford Wildcats, on the Waterford squad. They don't have, they don't, they did not have anybody that could body him and just play defense on him. So he had a phenomenal night. Second name is Jacob Coons. Jacob Coons is the senior leader that Coach Kurt Moore has been looking for all year. He had 23 points tonight, including four three pointers from behind the arc. You know, he was just on fire. The third name is Justice Jenkins. The young sophomore had 14 points and nine rebounds tonight. As I said, he's only a sophomore. He has two more years with Coach Kurt Moore, and he's very excited about what his future is. And now this team, they're going to continue on. They're going to play at the combo against Peebles next week. Uh, what are they going to have to do in order to win that game? Well, Blaine, Trimble needs to step up their defense. Tonight they showed a great a great job of how what they can do with their defense by switching it up all game long. They bring that in the next week, hold Peebles to, to um, contested jump shots and no open layups. I think they'll be all right. They also need to run their offense through Micah Couch. Again, they did a great job of that tonight, and I mean, the score proved it. Um, Couch is just a big man down low. Most teams don't have the, um, the big man that can body him. So if they, do that, if they do that, I think they can get a win against Beatles. And who better than Coach Kurt Moore and to tell us what he thinks his team can do in order to win? So keep working and doing what we do. We haven't had a chance to see Peebles. Uh, we have somebody out watching them tonight. So we'll look and see what they do. I know they have one of the best players in the district. So. We're just going to go in there and let her loose and see what happens. Man. Well, that's all the basketball we have for you right now, but make sure you tune into our program this Sunday evening at 11 p.m. on WOUB. And while you wait, make sure to check us out on the web at woub.org slash heroes. And then you can also like us on Facebook at Hardwood Heroes and follow us on Instagram at WOUB Sports. You can also follow us on Twitter at Hardwood Heroes and make sure to use that new hashtag, shoot for the shot. So for Austin Carpenter, I'm Blaine Carraher reminding you to be heroic.